Give it some. Go. Yeah. Dual carriageway. Interesting. He's on it. He's on it. 845's going. Julia is catching up though. Oh my word. This has turned into, this has gone from a tire review to uh, uh, Julia Quadrifoglio versus A45. And actually that was really interesting. guys welcome back to Steph AB TV and welcome to another Julia Quadrifoglio we're banging out Julia content however this car is not mine this is Richard's uh, those of you who don't know Richard uh, I'll leave a link to his Instagram below um, oh hello Richard was uh, with me on the road trip and this is his car this is his red Julia Quadrifoglio and it's absolutely stunning I love this car but the reason that I wanted to do this video is mainly because this car now has winter tires. It's got the Pirelli Soto Zero 2s, and um, mate, let's try this out. Because this is one of the things that um, I criticised well, when I had the car, when I had the car, and we got it by a rear set in a Fiesta Easy now. Now bear in mind that the last time I drove a Julia Quadrifoglio was about two weeks ago, um, so not that long at all. Um, so this is actually really, really good for me to, um, to do a direct comparison now, because the P0 Corsa tires when I had them. So when they're cold, um, they're very juddery. So the compound on that tire works well when you get heat into it, completely shocking uh, in the rain. Uh, and if you're if you're a bit confused, that is my A45 up in front. We're about to go for a hoon. But um, yeah, so the P0 Corsa tire, interestingly, when you get the heat into it, it softens up. It gives you a load more grip. But unfortunately, the conditions that I was in, I just couldn't get heat into it. It was raining, it was crap. But this, so the P0 Sotto Zero, which are a winter tyre for the Giulio Quadrifoglio. Now, specifically the tread, so you've got two types of, types of tread. The inner part of the tread, the setup, is obviously there to spread the water out to give you maximum grip. Uh, and the outer side is a bit stiffer and obviously it's... I don't know the ins and outs of it basically, I'm just waffling a little bit. But the important thing to note is already, being in this, the car feels so much softer. Um, so the tyre, the compound of the tyre, Oh, I've missed this car. I love this car. The tyre compound already on these kind of undulating roads around here feels great. And um, that didn't happen when I had the car before on the P0 course because the compound was so hard. Now, the big question is, you know, what's it like from a grip perspective? Now, let's try and find out. Let's slow it down. First gear. Okay. Oh my word. Oh, I'm impressed. Oh my. Okay. Right, let's just tone it down a little bit. So first impressions of this car with the P0 Soto Zero winter tyres. Well, first of all, the grip. There is so much more grip. Um, and you can see in the last time when I was driving this car, first and second, it was just spinning and even some of third, whereas now, oh, there go a little bit. Just, oh mate, that's sick. Yeah, that's sick. Grip is just on it. bit of slip there, a tiny bit, but nothing too major. Yeah, this is um, this is impressive. And do you know what? It's incredible how diff how much of a difference. Obviously, the road is a little drier. Arguably, though, it's colder now than it was when I had the Julia. Woo! Almost killed a pheasant. Um, but yeah, so it's incredible how how much difference a, a compound makes. And you know what? When you watch Formula One and you talk, you see how much difference time makes on tyres. Um, and without sounding too geeky, um, 
the, it, it makes or breaks your acceleration, it makes or breaks your handling on the car, um, because in something like this, which is so powerful, you need to be able to get the power down. And um, with these tires in, these, in this condition, you definitely can. Let's ask him. How was it? Oh, mate. You like it? I know, I saw, I was just saying. <laughs> oh, mate, hang on one sec. I was just saying, mate, that this car now with the tight is so much better. Amazing. Give it oh, some, go. Well. Yeah. <laughs> Dual carriageway. Interesting. Oh, look, the A45's going some. This has turned into, this has gone from a tyre review to uh, uh, Julia Quadrifoglio versus A45. And actually that was really interesting. Um, the A45 is quick, man. I'm impressed. He's on it, he's on it. A45's going. Julia is catching up though, oh my word. Julia. So interesting enough, so first and second on the A45 and the Julia, it's pretty similar. The A45 obviously four wheel drive plants that power down. But this, the moment this gets into third gear, you can just see that gap clawing. Oh. There's the beast, there's the beast. CC2LBA, that's another video. If you might've seen that one already, but what a car, what a car. Hey, sick, sick. do you like it? How was it? Awesome. It's good fun, isn't it? I can feel the the, uh, the mods. Yeah. Definitely. Well, both. The yeah, yeah, yeah. The suspension and the exhaust. It sounds great, doesn't it? Yeah, it's it's pretty fun. <laughs> in a good way. Yeah, it, well, mate, Flat, do you know, this is one of the things that, I, I know you, you said it to me literally as we were getting into that, but you're right, the difference in how soft it is. Yeah, it's driving. so compliant, isn't it? Mate, it's such a Going difference. Going from mine to yours just now. Yeah, I know it's going to be back-breaking for me yeah. getting back into that, but mate, honestly, I love that. And, and it puts the pound down a lot, a lot better as well. Completely. But, yeah. My view, in summary, is that I think that's 90% of the performance of the Corsa tyre. Yeah. But all the time. Yeah, it's that amazing. Basically how I'm, feeling. I'm loving the tyres. Mate, literally, it, it's more than I expected. Such a good drive. I'm such a good... Mate, I love it. Yeah. I absolutely love this car, and I'm sure you guys are all fan favourites of it, but in that colour, it's such a beautiful colour. But yeah. <laughs> Nice to right. see it chasing me as well. Yeah, and I was saying it's great seeing that thing go as well, yeah, man. Yeah, I bet. I was saying, so it's second gear when we joined the motorway, mm. um, second gear they were level, and then third gear, this just claws, man. Yeah. This just unleashes so, all sorts of power in third gear. Yeah, I saw you going towards me. Yeah. Oh, hey. Hey, hello, Julia. Yeah, hey. But anyway, right, thank you, mate, for lending me your car. Anytime. Most sure I appreciate it. But guys, right, that's it. I'm going to end this video here. So the difference between the P0 Corsa tyre and the Soto Zero is definitely noticeable, particularly in these conditions. Um, but I hope you guys have enjoyed the video have enjoyed the video i love this car it's so incredibly good and uh, yeah i'm going to see you all very soon on the next one make sure to subscribe thank you Bye.